It couldn't have started better for Gillingham. 15 minutes gone, a free kick from Paul Watson put the Kent side one up. He doesn't score many, this was only his second of the season, but when he does score, they're worth seeing again. Gillingham lived dangerously a few minutes later. Penalty area pinball letting Colchester's Chris Fry. Keeper Steve Banks did well, Richard Carpenter cleared the danger. Gillingham couldn't keep the Essex team out though. Simon Betts with a second half penalty equaled the scores. With just three minutes remaining, Gillingham went behind. Niall Thompson, the scorer. He also added Colchester's third one minute later to give Gills their first home defeat in five league games. Despite the 3-1 loss, Gillingham remained fourth from bottom.